SMT Nation, we got a cool video for you guys here today. I know some people have been really excited about N77, 3.7 gigahertz, you know, the Goldilocks spectrum of 5G and all that. And uh, T-Mobile has been really pushing the envelope with 5G, with the 5G UC going with N41, 2.5 gigahertz. But a lot of people forget, you know, it just goes unnoticed or forgotten. They also have C-band. 3.7 gigahertz, and they have 3.45 gigahertz in places too. And they can start to deploy this pretty soon. And it looks like there are permits. And I want to give a, a big shout out to RaccoonCast over on Twitter. He posted this, and I, I caught it in my feed, so I wanted to share it. So big shout out to them, and uh, appreciate you sharing this. So let's take a look here. All right, these are kind of like the important elements of what you want to look at when you're trying to you know, look to see what exactly is going up on these tower sites. So this is a permit and this is the, what's called the antenna schedule. This is essentially the radio gear that they're going to put up on these tower sites. All right. Well, what you guys see here is alpha, beta, gamma. These are the three sectors on a tower site. And uh, here are the technologies that they utilize. These are the, actually the frequencies, right? So, and the bands. All right. So this is N77, that's C band. Uh, I can tell you guys that this is going to be just based on this lettering here. I think this is going to be the 3.7 gigahertz. It's not going to be the 3.45. I don't think the last time I remembered when I looked at permits for Verizon and AT&T, they designate the D right here, 877D. That lettering is for the 3.7 gigahertz. And when it has a G at the end, I think it's the 3.45. Correct me if I'm wrong. Some of you guys may know out there, but that's what it appeared to be the last time I checked because Verizon doesn't have 3.45 gigahertz and their permits don't show the G. They all show, you know, letter D. All right, let's see. Uh, this is Ericsson. So this is LA, by the way, Los Angeles, California, which is an Ericsson market. So you're going to see the antenna and radio combination. That's Air 6449. That's the type of antenna radio combo. Uh, it's a like a two in one, right? So they go together. And you'll see sometimes they like with the radios, they're identified here with these like RRUs when they're describing certain types of hardware. So, for example, here on this one, you have the 700 megahertz L700. That means band 12. Uh, L600 is band 71. N600 is N71, the 5G version. L1900 is the PCS 1.9 gigahertz. L2100 is band 66. That's AWS. And then G1900, that's Sprint's PCS. Okay. And then it describes like all the technical stuff here. All right. And then it shows you all the configurations. Here it's going to be two radios. You've got the low band stuff, which putting up, it says here band 8.5. I, I don't know. that that is that 850 megahertz? I, I don't even know what that is. Does that say 85? I can't even really tell. Maybe you guys can see, but. Uh, here is the L25. That's, you know, the LT version of N41. And then here's the N41. That's the uh, EBS BRS stuff. All right. And there's like the radios and, and all that. Anyway, so you got three sectors, you know, gives you all the specs here. And uh, this is what we're going to see. This is going to be a T-Mobile upgrade. It's getting the um, all the upgrades done. And uh, any other details that I could tell here? that are important. Uh, maybe you guys have been looking at these and, and you know more about these upgrades. You've seen them. Uh, but from what I can tell, this is going to be a pretty fast site. It's going to create a lot of capacity. Now, LA has like a lot of people. There's a lot of pops in LA, right? Tons and tons of people. So these upgrades are going to probably be happening more frequently. I'm also not exactly sure what's pre-existing. You know, I don't know if this site was completely just being renovated and upgraded now or if some of the stuff was already up or or whatever but this is obviously the new and this is getting installed brand new all right this is the first time i've seen a permit for c-band on t-mobile very exciting this site's going to be fast they're probably going to give it a multi gig circuit because you're going to have what do they have like 40 megahertz in la of n77 all right and then you've got five five 15 you know the uh, the pcs they probably have like 40 or more megahertz of it paired uh this is probably 160 megahertz of n41 
You know what I mean? I don't know if they're going to leave any on LTE or whatever. I think that those days are done because they're going to be shutting that down probably in July or something. I don't know. But uh, I'm just thinking aloud. You're going to need good fiber. So multi-gig circuits are in order. So they're going to have to do the transport, reach out to upgrade that. And uh, this is going to be a fast site. This will be really fast. You guys let me know if you've been seeing these permits. Let me know if you've been seeing these upgrades. I can't wait to see the first pictures of them putting up that gear. Because that tells you that T-Mobile is very serious about upgrading for capacity. Remember, places like this, this is all mobility. This is not fixed wireless access upgrades. That's going to be, you know, more rural, suburban. In the urban, eh, I don't know, man. I guess if they created enough capacity, they could do it. We'll see. Uh, sound off in the comment section below. You all the voice of the people of the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard. Big shout out to Raccoon Cast. I'm going to heart that. Thanks, man. Appreciate you sharing this. Uh, like, share, subscribe for more, and turn on the bell notifications so you never miss an upload. Links in the description for my Twitter. Also, my Patreon page. Support us there and get early access to content and exclusive videos not found anywhere else. Also, my Gmail address uh, for all business inquiries. You guys can get it there. And uh, thanks again for watching. See you all in the next one. Peace.